Hi guys, this is a little video update for all of you that want to know how is Fabian going. Still and, alive. Yeah, and how is the situation here in Mexico. In this video we will show you how was our tour around Morelia. We will also show how was when we went to the doctor with Fabian. And then we were waiting here in this parking spot here in Morelia. It's pretty amazing, they have everything. We were here two weeks and today we are going then towards another state to find a place where we can do a quarantine in a Kalmar city because are really crazy and pretty cool because they have all kinds of things you can find it from fruit vegetables you can yep. find anything that you want you will see now a little how was our tour here that is so well connected with the public transportation are those little white vans you will see it's all about those white vans everywhere La Moreliana, that is a sweet from here from the area, and this is made with milk, cinnamon, and other things. And we will try. Nice, that's it. Let's try. Mm. It's good, it's like dulce de leche, kind of, but not so sweet. You want to try it? Delicious. Yesterday we came here tonight in the cathedral. I can show you a little video of that. Now we are walking the Plaza de Armas and it's pretty cool because they have all those trees with nice cuts and at night they have also light and looks beautiful. It's a really nice place to hang out, to enjoy with the friends, to be on the shade, to eat an ice cream. And the difference that we see between Morelia and other cities that we went here in Mexico 
is that Morelia don't have those colors that Mexico has and you don't see so much stands like foods you guys can see now around here there's no food stands we have a really feeling that we are like in Europe because it's everything like made with those rock styles and stones looks really like being Madrid or Barcelona instead of being Mexico look at that how oh, nice beautiful structure wow look at that We are in El Palacio de la Justicia. This is really big. But the view from up probably is nice. There it is, the fountain that she said. Now it's only a museum, but before they use it for justice. here in the neighborhood in Morelia and it's something that we like to do a lot to walk around and see the houses around we don't feel any kind of danger the opposite to the parking lots that we found here in Morelia it's amazing so amazing that we can plug electricity <laughs> there we have police 24 7 there taking care of the area and dogs can be free it's pretty cool we like a lot a lot of people said don't go there because Michoacan is level blah blah dangerous right now we don't have any of that feeling we really like this area and we are glad that we came here to visit Morelia there it is this is the parking lot here in Morelia now it's full but the last two days were empty and the nice part is that they have here electricity and you can plug your truck if you ask them there it is here's electricity we were plugged here before here is a toilet you pay like three pesos and we can pass with our box and then there are toilets there and here's the water we can fill our tank with water so love this parking spot because they can run free they can enjoy the grass there is a lot of shade look at this beautiful trees we are still in Morelia and today we are going to a hospital with Fabian only to be sure that he don't have anything bad he has a lot of coughing and some kind of cold sometimes yeah and we want to check all that to be sure now with this corona thing on the world and of course because he needs medicine because it's everything green inside then let's see how we do that tests and they gave us the corona masks yes <laughs> we needed to be with that that's really annoying but important looks like and we are here waiting that the tests come out it's just the flu 
Yeah, he had a really tough flu. <coughs> but I can't get rid of it, so that's the problem. I coughed since two months, and that's why we went for a So all good. Yeah. <laughs> you get them? And now? This morning I just went for a checkup, and now it's taking me stuff. Yeah. Hi guys, <laughs> we are still here in the hospital and because the family has a lot of coughing and a kind of a flu, they order to do the blood test to check if he have the coronavirus. Everybody before here were without masks and the whole hospital has masks right now. It's crazy. And we are waiting that the state send somebody to take the blood to be sure that he's not with the coronavirus. So Mexico is sending something and they will test Another blood test if it's Corona. I don't think so. Yeah, we don't think so. Yeah. But they will send somebody yeah. official. Yeah. <laughs> Keep your post. Here we have the professional of epidemiology, I think is in English. And Fagan is with coronavirus or not? No. He don't have a coronavirus, we are really <laughs> happy about that. <laughs> we are still testing what exactly we can have, but there's no corona. We can take masks off. We are ready, I think, a week here because Fabian got a little sick or more sick than he was already and we decided to go to the hospital and they did a few tests on him and we were we are here waiting to see uh, what the results will come with in Mexico the situation is still pretty relaxed you don't feel like that there is this whole corona uh, pandemia in the whole world people still do their own stuff you still see people having normal life then let's hope there is not so many people that get the coronavirus here and yeah is what we can do rest and wait and hope for the best using, using our time that we need to wait until Fabian is better to clean the car and clean the front that have so much hair we just got Fabian results and Right now we are going to the doctor to see exactly what he has and get the right treatment. So we have the test in hand and we need medicine now and hope that he will be better soon. Hi guys. Right now we are at the doctor and finally the first doctor in two months finally found a solution. <laughs> so here's my doctor. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> and he's gonna write me a recipe or whatever you say for the right antibiotics 10 more days and it's pneumonia whatever that is it's a bacteria that stressed me three months now so to say quarantine it's not I mean coronavirus is all over the world right now it's hitting Mexico we are pretty sure we can't go down to South America Guatemala Belize is closed United States I think I don't know if it's already but they will close to Mexico um, so flying home to Europe doesn't make sense for us and the dogs. No. So we decided to stay in Mexico. Mm -hmm. We love it. Viva Mexico. I have unfortunately this pneumonia bacteria in me, which is not Corona, no. but unfortunately I carried it too long in me. So I'm really weak right now. I have fever at night. I'm, you know, I'm taking medicine. It's all good, but I cannot afford to get hit by Corona right now. So that's why we look for a place. That's why she said quarantine. Yeah. <laughs> we look for a place quiet in the mountains or on the beach, whatever you think. Leave a comment what's better yes. and we're gonna do that. See you when we see you. Bye bye.